Say yo! Welcome to the BBW Show, you feel me? We talk battle rap, basketball, and wrestling on a daily basis. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't. The topic for today is... The Golden State Warriors. Yes, 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 yes. If you do not know, Draymond Green has just been suspended five games. Five games for choking out Rudy Gobert in the Minnesota versus Golden State game. You feel me? Very controversial moment. Very controversial. A lot of people thought he was going to be suspended for 10 games. Some people thought he should be suspended for none. Like me. I thought he shouldn't be suspended for none. I felt like he got ejected already. That's it. Ended right there. You feel me? I didn't think the NBA was going to suspend him. He's suspended for five games now. Not only that, Steph Curry is injured and is going to be reevaluated in a week. You feel me? So he's going to miss time. Golden State is looking really, really bad. Really, really bad. I knew the Chris Paul pickup wasn't going to work. I knew that wasn't going to work. Um, Klay Thompson is looking like... Klay Thompson, people think, is the worst player in the A. I'm going to just say that. People are thinking he's the worst player in the A. People are talking about trading him. People are not acting like he scored 34 in a quarter. People not acting like he's a four-time champion. Like, he's starting off the season bad, but niggas is talking about trading him away to Chicago for Zach Levine. I would definitely take Klay Thompson over Zach Levine any day of the week. Especially right now, you feel me? Especially with the playoffs coming on. Like, bro, uh-uh, uh-uh. Niggas is shitting on Klay Thompson, you feel me? Um, I feel like there's a lot of reasons why Golden State is bad right now. A lot of reasons. One, the Chris Paul thing, like I said, is not going to work. I feel like Chris Paul and Steph Curry's way better rivals than they're going to be teammates. Way better rivals than they're going to be teammates. Um, Klay Thompson, like I said, hasn't played good. None of Golden State young boys have stepped up. I'm not going to lie. Kaminga has not stepped up to me. Gary Payton Jr. is ass. I ain't going to lie. Besides defense, Gary Payton Jr. doesn't have nothing. He has no type of offense, no shot, no nothing. You feel me? Moody, same thing. It's like only good person that they got that's young is Kevon Looney. That's the only person they got, and he don't got no offensive game. He straight pick and roll and rebounds. It's like, bro, Golden State is really, really bad. One of the things that made them great the last few years was their bench and their veteran leadership. They had Eagle Dollar, Sean Livingston, Leonardo Barbosa, like, they had old heads, you hear me? They had real pros. Real, real pros. Real pros. I feel like now they just got young boys. They traded Wiseman. I forgot what they traded. They traded him for Gary Payton. They traded him for Gary Payton, who they let walk. So I was like, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Come on. Come on. Golden State is mad small. They don't really got it big. But they've been like that. It's just now Klay Thompson is not making the shots that he used to make. He's not being a lockdown two-way defender that he used to be. So now it's like, niggas is on that ass now. Niggas is on that ass now, bro. I'm not going to lie. Niggas is on that ass now with Golden State. Um, I feel like Andrew Wiggins hasn't stepped up yet. He was supposed to be the number three option. He hasn't turned out to be that yet either. So I don't know if they need to make some trades or not. But right now, the path they're going, Golden State is not looking good. Not looking good. And the next couple of games... They play the Suns, they play the Spurs, they play the Thunder, they play the Clippers. Like, they play a lot of good Western Conference teams. A lot of good Western Conference teams. Even if the Clippers is doing bad, that's going to be a great game. You feel me? I feel like if the Golden State don't make a good move or start winning by Christmas time, they got to make a trade. They got to make a trade. But I wouldn't trade... Clay Thompson. I would not trade Clay Thompson. You feel me? You need to keep them together. You need to keep them together. If you trade Clay Thompson, that's a message to Stephen Curry and Draymond Green. Like, yeah, this is over with. This is fake over with. You feel me? And once y'all get old, we're going to trade y'all too. Golden State needs to build that, keep that tradition. You feel me? Like, yeah, we kept these niggas our whole, they whole run. Same thing like they did in San Antonio. They whole run, we kept them. You hear me? Kept these niggas together. Yeah, they probably played one, two years somewhere else. Like, Tony Parker had a season with the um, Hornets. Nobody cares about that. You feel me? But their prime years were spent on Golden State. I feel like it's too soon to break them thumb three up, but it's not too soon to make moves. 
That's my opinion. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Like, comment, share, subscribe. I'll be back with more.